Hi, in this video we're going to create a music uh, genre quiz. Uh, when the user click run, he's having like um, a main screen or a starting screen. Click take a quiz. Here we're having what a volume do you listen to music? And from the drop down menu here, the user have uh, three uh, options, soft, medium, loud and for the activities he would like to do we're having another drop down menu with different three activities do a puzzle work out go for a drive he's going to select any of the two options here for the music and for example this is do a puzzle uh, a puzzle see result you are pop okay to create the same quiz we're going to click create app lab as it is our IDE or integrated development environment rename the project with your name and assignment 3 okay and click say click on design select any theme you wish i'm okay with this one uh, we need to place a button in the middle the id will be start underscore btn and for the text it will be take a quiz okay then we're having some images here feel free to add them with any uh, style you wish drag an image from the property the image property choose select icons music note another one with a headphone for example icons again a headphone we may have a last one here with a mic or mic okay or speakers whatever you want uh, when user click take a quiz he will open a second screen with the quiz questions so we're going to drag another screen okay uh, sorry i forgot to change i forgot to change the id of screen one so from the drop down menu i selected the screen one change its id to be home screen okay we may separate them with an underscore for screen 2 I'm gonna make it quiz underscore screen on screen 2 we're going to display a label and change the text of that label with the question here okay I'm going to select it all and paste it here we may change the size scroll down and change the font color to be like 15 or 17 then we need to add the drop down menu with the word soft medium and loud okay so drag a drop down menu place it here on the options uh, property we're going to write medium soft and loud each one on a line so each one will be an option 
on the drop down menu that will appear when we click run okay we didn't do the the code to open uh, the quest so i will be back to design and we're gonna see it when we run our program and uh, now we need a label for the other uh, custom this one okay change its text property again this will be 17 and I'm going to resize it and then the other drop down menu with the three answers okay on the options property we didn't change the id of the first drop down menu here i named it at volume drop down and the other one activity drop down volume underscore drop down and this one to be activity underscore drop down we're done with the second screen the last screen okay this screen the result it has three icons okay uh, a label with you are then we're having a button for retaking a cause we're gonna do it quickly I'm going to add only one. Feel free to add more. Okay. And here we need a label. Its ID will be result underscore output. And here you are okay i need to change the size of it change the alignment to be center and here i'm gonna add a button oh the id will be retake underscore btn for button on it we're gonna type re take the quest okay now we're gonna start the code click on code step one will be on the home screen when we click take a quest it will open the quiz screen so on event when user click the start ptn start ptn we're going to set screen which is open screen watch screen the quiz screen okay so this is number one run click here now we are on the second screen okay actually we need like three variables why do we need three variables we're having three different inputs first input the input will be taken from the volume drop down menu soft medium or loud this is input number one input number two the activity that will be taken from the drop down menu or the activity drop down menu work out go for drive uh, do a puzzle and so on this is input number two input number three will be the result that will be displayed on the last screen 
okay which is your music type so from variables we're going to create three variables var x well, i choose to select var x as there is no need for giving a starting value for my variables okay volume this one will represent the um, the type of volume soft medium or loud volume the second one will be activity which will take its value from the drop down menu of the activities the last one will be the result that will be displayed on the last screen or third screen now i need to tell my program where the uh, variable volume will take from where the variable volume will take its value using x equal assign a value now i'm using my variable that's why there is no need for using a var x okay of volume equal get text taking a text from volume drop down menu ui get text displayed on volume drop down menu okay we need another one x equal activity variable equal the text will be taken from the activity drop down menu okay get text activity drop down menu sorry this is the home screen activity drop down menu okay our program will work when we click run click on take a quiz then select from the drop down menu uh, the volume then the activity we will be doing then clicking on C result to open the result screen and see what is our result so we need to drag an on event when we click on the result button I want to see the quest screen its result button from design i need to change okay missing e okay the id here will be result button on click on it what will happen we're going to add an f statement okay when the user select from the volume uh, drop down menu if the selected value is soft so from math i need an equality equation if the volume okay the variable volume which will equal to the values of the drop down menu if volume equal to soft if this is true the variable result will equal result will equal to classic your music type will be classic okay if this is false not true i need to retest again so click on plus this is else i need another else if a new condition from math equal operator again 
This time activity, activity the variable, which will take its value from the drop down menu of the activity. So activity may equal go for drive. Okay. I'm going to copy it. Go for a drive. So now variable result will equal to country music last option if both are false the last one will be result equal pop okay احنا لحد دلوقتي عملنا 3 variables اول variable ادني له value equal to selection من ال drop down menu وليه عملت variable لاني مش عارفة من الاول هو اليوزر ممكن يختار which option from the drop down menu تمام و عملت واحد تاني اسمه activity with the same concept انا برضو مش عارفة اليوزر ممكن يعمل select which option from the drop down menu اوكي Uh, الفاريبل الاخير اللي هو ريزالت اجي يعني تاني انا برضو مش عارفه ويتش سلكشن وريزالت ده هيتحدد اكوردنج تو ذا اف ستيتمنت اوكي ريزالت ده اللي هو الفاينل انا عايزه اقول له لما لو اخترت سوفت يبقى انت التايب بتاع كلاسيك لو اخترت الاكتيفيتي جو فور ا درايف سو يور تايب از كونتري ذا Final result will be Bob if both are false. If it's not soft and it's not go for a drive. ممكن بقى تبقى ال volume medium. احنا يعني عندنا كذا option في ال volume وعندنا كذا option في ال activity. Okay. Type. When we're done, we're gonna click on see result. And we're going to open the Uh, uh, last screen the screen 3 which we didn't change its name result underscore screen from code I want to set screen to result screen ok set screen Set screen will open the needed screen result screen. Okay. Type. على result screen أنا عندي label اسمه result outcome. و I need to display the value of the variable result. So simply set text for result outcome. Hmm. It will equal to the value of the variable result. برضو عايزين نخلي شكلها presentable. So drag plus label with u u r and here I'm gonna write the value of the variable. Result, okay. Run. Take a quiz. I'm gonna select medium and work out. So the result should be yes. It should be Bob. See result. You are Bob. If we wish to retake the quiz, when we click on retake a quiz, it should return us back to the home screen. So UI on event, on event on what? On the button retake. Okay, when we click on it, what will happen? We're going to set screen. on screen home screen to return back 
Now we may add some amendments or some modifications on the uh, start button. I'm gonna add like play sound. So play sound from here and choose. Mm, we may select this one. Search for open screen as well. Mm, notification. Choose. Okay. The same for copy and paste here. And another one here. Okay. If you wish, you may add. Uh, like uh, comments uh, that will explain um, the parts of your code okay uh, drag the comment anywhere I'm having one here okay I'm going to add it before the variables inside them you may uh, type creating three variables And explain uh, why do we use each variable and the value of each variable and so on by the way um, the comments they man لازم تبتدي ب two backslash دي حاجة حاجة تانية هم مش بيتعمل لهم execute executing مع الكود since إن هم since in the line بتاع ال comment ده ابتدى ب two slashes ال program هيعتبر ان ده comment كأنه بالظبط مش موجود وهو بيعمل run لل program تمام هو بس موجود علشان يخلي ال code more clear عشان اي حد يقرا ال code بتاعك يفهم انت عامل ال variable ده ليه عامل ال f statement دي ليه تمام هو كده extra explanation for the code okay thanks for watching or well, i'm waiting to see your assignment thank you